Coming up on Apex TV 360. The virtual Apex experience will be here before you know it. We'll have tips on how to make the most out of your experience. Hi everyone, I'm Kimberly Bottom for Apex TV 360. The virtual Apex experience is right around the corner and we couldn't be more excited. So in this episode, we're highlighting opportunities attendees should take advantage of during this virtual event. We want to remind you to please remember to register on apexshow.com. It's free and you'll wanna take advantage of the accredited training sessions. Sessions will focus on key topics and trends. The virtual platform means physical space doesn't constrain the number of sessions that are available to you without the time or expense needed to travel. As a result, you'll find a robust schedule packed with opportunities. Sessions include, but are not limited to, a perpetual business, your ultimate objective, breaking the mold, getting out of the price-based model and into the value-based model, electronic power steering explained, and European diagnostics, what you need to know. For the full list of sessions, head to apexshow.com. Training will also be offered at Joe's Garage. Simply head to the Joe's Garage section on the platform. Kukui spoke about what they plan to highlight during the virtual Apex experience. It's so important for us to be part of Joe's Garage this year because this is the place where all shops can go to get answers to all their questions that they may have had about, about many different areas inside of your garage. Our training this year with Kikui is going to go specifically into the seven areas of success that you see with your shop, whether it is your increasing your online presence, whether it's increasing your new customer acquisition, increasing your customer retention, are you looking for work-life balance? We're going to bring all of this together in one presentation where you can go home directly from this information and make changes in your business, make changes in your life. You can also see demos from other exhibitors in Joe's Garage. These include 360 Payments, BG Products, Bolt-On Technology, Bosch, Broadly, Coats, Eurovent, Hunter, Kukui, Michelin, Mitchell One, Napa, Shot Boss, and Techmetric. And make sure to schedule some one-on-one -on -one time with these exhibitors and watch their demos. In addition, this year's keynote sessions will keep you ahead of the curve. This year's keynote session will focus on the future. It's titled, What to Expect on the Road Ahead. This session will include opening remarks from Bill Hanvey, President and CEO of the Auto Care Association, and Paul McCarthy, President and COO of AASA. They'll introduce a panel that includes Sue Godshulk, Vice President of Federated Auto Parts, Eric Sills, CEO of Standard Motor Products, Duncan Gillis, CEO of BBB Industries, Tom Greco, President and CEO of Advance Auto Parts, and Greg Johnson, CEO of O'Reilly. The keynote session will be held on Tuesday, November 3rd from 12 to 12.45 p.m. The sessions will be available on demand after they air within the platform, but not on the website. Some sessions will be live streamed to apexshow.com. Day two of the virtual Apex experience will include two panel discussions. Bill Hanvey and Paul McCarthy will also make remarks during this discussion. First, the panelists will talk about the previous day's Massachusetts vote on the right to repair. That panel includes Bill Hanvey, President and CEO of Auto Care Association, Aaron Lowe, SVP, Government and Regulatory Affairs of the Auto Care Association, Ray Pullman, President of the Coalition for Auto Repair Equality, Michael Bohr, President of Allied Auto Parts, Tom Hickey, Spokesperson for the Massachusetts Right to Repair Committee, and a shop owner from Massachusetts. Then another panel will discuss what the election means for our business. Panelists include Aaron Lowe, SVP, Government and Regulatory Affairs of the Auto Care Association, Ann Wilson, SVP of Government Affairs of MEMA, AASA, David McKinney, VP of Government and Community Relations of AutoZone, and Ian P. Musselman, SVP Government Affairs of LKQ. 
That session will be held on Wednesday, November 4th from 2 to 3 p.m. We'll also have live session recaps throughout the show that are sure to keep you ahead of the curve. They'll be held on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday from 1.30 to 2 p.m. and 5.30 to 6. Live session recaps will feature industry leaders recapping sessions that aired earlier that day, and they're gonna discuss the major takeaways. We'll also be giving away registration for Apex 2021, which includes a four-night hotel stay. Winners will be selected at random during the live session recap. The winners will be chosen from the group of participants who are watching the live session recap. They'll be chosen at random. In terms of ROI for attendees, the Virtual Apex Experience is going to be a can't-miss event. You get to meet exhibitors face-to-face -face over the digital platform in pre-scheduled meetings and learn about their new products and technologies. Simply express an interest in meeting with a particular exhibitor and they should schedule a meeting with you. You can also set up your own meeting by searching a person's name in the platform. A chat function is also available for you to use. Apex is also offering training that discusses how to conduct successful virtual meetings. We encourage you to take a look when you have a free moment. The next 30-minute training will be presented on October 29th at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. However, if you can't make it, don't worry, because you can access the recording on apexshow.com. So mark your calendars now for the virtual Apex experience. It runs November 3rd through the 5th. Registration is free for attendees on apexshow.com. And as always, the Apex community is buzzing, particularly about this year's event. So join the conversation about this virtual experience via Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and LinkedIn. Just be sure to use the hashtag virtualapex. That does it for this episode of Apex TV 360. I'm Kimberly Bottom. Thanks for watching.